we're going to briefly go over the new annotation symbol command which can be found by going to the startup screen new annotations or through the application menu new annotation symbol as you can see that we have a number of different starting points that we can choose from but really it's kind of a limited selection so if you don't see what you need chances are you are either going to want to start with generic annotation or generic tag so let's click on the generic tag right off the bat I can see that I've got some reference planes which define my point of origin for insertion a note which helps me get things started I'm just going to delete that for now go up to my category and parameters and specify the tag type that I want otherwise they will fall underneath generic model tags I'm going to choose area tag for right now if I go and add a label and specify a category parameter right here you can see it says area type and my sample value is also set to area type now let's say that I change my mind and I want to switch my tag to function for a different category if I go up here and specify something like a ceiling tag I have to be aware that my label no longer is going to function the way that I think it will so I have to come up here and check that and here I can see that my parameter is set to model and my sample value is area type which really isn't going to work so the best option is to go ahead and delete this then choose the correct category parameter that you want so I'm just going to say mark add that and there you can see my parameter name and my sample value say OK other than adding a label your next most used command underneath the create panel would be more likely to be lines we can go in and add some line work I'm ready to go ahead and load this into my project which I can do right there